Well, good damn afternoon, Americans. Jericho Green here with you once again, you mother suckers. Give me a follow on X at Green underscore Jericho. Like and subscribe to this channel and my new channel, Green's House. Damn it, we made it. It is November 5th. 2024 it's election day a year well trump ran against two idiots remember because we started with sloppy joe then he got the boot remember when we they grab somebody one person grabs your arms the other one grabs your feet and they go one two three and they throw you you know how those, those dictators would throw the dead bodies into the, the ditches? That's what they did to Sloppy Joe. Two, one person grabbed his hands. Another person grabbed his feet. Pelosi, Pelosi grabbed his hands. Obama grabbed his feet. And they said a one and a two and a tossed his ass right out of the Oval Office. So first, we started with Sloppy Joe, who has a, a head full of sawdust. Then we moved on to Kamala, the Ugandan nightmare, the one who had been inserted. Isn't that ironic? She was inserted, and Willie Brown and a bunch of others inserted things into her. Makes sense. The circle of life. So then they got rid of Sloppy Joe. They put a political hit out on that <laughs> And here comes the queen of cackling. And Trump did a great job against both the propaganda from the left, the bullshit, the lies, the taken out of context, the willful ignorance, the insults. We made it. It's November 5th. Now, what are you going to do to reward yourself for making it through 365 days of horse shit? Watching his sorry ass speeches, the debate. Watching her crazy ass fall apart in front of paid crowds. We made it through all that shit. The garbage has made it. And now it's time for the garbage to stand up and fucking say something. I text my best friend, asked me you voting. I ran into my neighbor. He's dropping off his ballot this morning. We need to vote. It's a damn shame that we have in the back of our minds that this bitch could win. Now, I'll be doing a live stream later tonight, probably 8 o'clock. Keep your eyes peeled. I'll, I'll uh, put it up on all my social media platforms. Definitely going live. Hopefully, we can get the results tonight. Remember, in 2016, it's about, what, 2 o'clock in the morning? I'll take that. I just want the results before I go to bed. That's my wife texting me, knowing I'm doing a video. But I'll be doing a live stream, like I said, around 8 o'clock. Hopefully we get them tonight. Why not? Why should it take days or tens of hours, 12, 24, 36 hours to get the results? You know what to expect. How many presidential elections have we been through? Have the people in place to count the ballots so we, the people, can know what the hell is going on ASAP. But I'm excited. I've been waiting for this. We have been waiting for this. The day is here. The anticipation is crazy. Will we have Donald J. Trump as the 47th president as we should? Or will we be bent over and fucked one more time like we were in 2020 and get Kamala the Ugandan nightmare as president of these United States? That sounds crazy as hell to say out loud. I want a repeat of 2016. I want to see memes the next day of all these blue-haired, granola-headed dirt fuckers screaming and crying and needing to take a day off of work or school because Trump was elected president. That's what we need. That's what we deserve. Do you realize that we had to suffer through four years of sloppy Joe? Do you remember what that is like? 
If you put your ear to your wallet right now, you can hear your debit cards and your credit cards sobbing. Because they have been overused and overworked just like Kamala's mouth. Your finances, you've been kicked in your financial nuts for four years. When you go to the grocery store, come here, turn around. No, no, no. Boom. Right in your nuts. When you go to the pump, turn around. No, 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 that hurts. Boom. Right in your nuts again. Your mortgage, your internet, your property tax, your clothes, the supplies for your business. Come here, turn around. Wham! Right in your nuts for four years. And now we finally have the opportunity to stop. To give our financial scrotum a break, a respite. Get your ass out there to vote. Contact people that you know. Tell them to get out and vote for Trump. Could you imagine? What Joy Reid, the view, the short-haired Michael J. Fox looking Ricky Maddow, Scarborough, Howard Stern, the Hollywood perverts, all the attendees of a Diddy party and Epstein Island, how they're going to celebrate if Kamala Harris becomes president. Oh, my God. Oh my God. Bro. Oh. I don't mean so terrible. Oh shit. But it won't end that way. And yes, I have a, in the back of my mind, just in case, what I'm going to say if Kamala Harris gets elected. I don't, I don't even know. I don't even want to think about it, but I have to. Because you better be sure, I know exactly what I'm going to say when Trump gets elected. Oh, I'm going to act a natural fool. Again, because of the aforementioned four years of financial kicks to the balls. Pick a continent. We're, on, we're at war. or we're, we're fighting a proxy war. We're financing one side or, in, in one case, both sides. We're paying one side to bomb the other side, and then we're giving the other side band-aids and food and shit like that. We're paying both sides. All of that will come to an end. The war in Ukraine will be over. That bullshit in the desert will be over. The high prices will be over. Out of control government spending will be over. Hopefully RFK can make a dent, if not take care of the poisons that are being siphoned into our bodies by these corporations, these food companies, the FDA who basically works for them. I am happier than a pig and shit. As my dad would say, I am happier than a ag with a fist full of dicks. <laughs> Vote Trump. Do it now if you haven't already. And like I said, I'll be doing a live stream later on. I cannot wait. Make sure you guys are there. But you know how it goes. I try to be done with the left, but they just won't let me. Please subscribe. Hit that notification bell because every time it rings, a piece of shit lefty cries. Utilize the link tree link. Give me a follow on X at green underscore Jericho. Like and subscribe to my new channel, Green's House. I am Jericho Green. You better vote for Trump. I'm out.